Greetings, you scum. My name is Krusty, and welcome to Shadow of the Colossus. This is the PS4 remake of the game, but I've never played this game before in my little life. I've always wanted to. It's been on my long list of games to play. Eventually, I'll get around to playing them. This is my time to play it now with the remake, the re-release of it. Um, I'm really excited about it because I've heard so many great things, and I'm just I'm, I'm really pumped up to jump into it and experience this for the very first time. I'm going to do this video a little bit differently than I normally would as well. Because I usually edit things quite heavily and try and cut them down a lot. This is something I'm going to try something a little bit different. And if you guys like it, maybe we'll continue it and do more games on it in the future. And I'm not going to edit as much. I'm going to try and resist edi editing as much. So it's just a more kind of peaceful, relaxed experience. More engrossing. And I don't miss out on showing you guys if you have not experienced this game for yourself. I don't miss out on showing you just the, the wonder and the, the mystique uh, in, in all its glory in this game. As much as possible, I like to try and avoid that. But let's start a new game! On normal, I guess, because normal is normal, normal is how it's supposed to be played. I don't know anything about this game. By the very obvious, you you climb up giants and stuff. That's all I know. I, I don't know anything. I've never played um, uh, The Last Guardian, which is the most recent one, uh, made by the same people, or Ico, I think. I've never played any of those games, but this is the one on the top of the list that I've always wanted to play. Because again, I've heard so many great things. But I guess this will be my character riding the horse right now, huh? Make it a grand entrance to some place. The horse may be wise, maybe you should listen to the horse. But it's easily convinced, I guess. I'm interested in the technology behind that door. Right there. It's like... Do they have a beeper? Like you, you arrive at your garage, you're in the car, you press beep and the garage goes up and down. Does he possess that? Doesn't quite seem like the world to include things like that. Why do I know? This is fiction, they can make it what they want. I'm going to have to resist talking so much as well, actually, in this. Just, I took a little break from talking for about five seconds there and I just listened. And among the great things I've heard about this game, like the visuals and the atmosphere, is the sound. And it's quite enjoyable to listen to. Have I got a baby or a child or something on me there? Is it my baby or child? Did I steal the baby or child? Maybe I'm a, a serial baby stealer and child stealer. But what for, you might wonder. Ooh, look at those statues. Are they the Colossus? Colossi? I haven't even done anything yet, but I'm really pumped up and excited to play this. As I said, it's the sound that kind of gets me into it. I'm liking the music as well, quite a lot. I don't know how many things have changed from the original. I guess the best idea, because it is a classic, would be not to change that much. Just just change the textures and the lighting and stuff like that a little bit. So I don't know how much has changed. I, it's going to totally go over my head if anything has uh, been changed drastically, but I'm just going to... I'm just going to immerse myself and not worry too much about it. Her feet are probably really cold. Are her feet cold? Ooh, very dramatic. I imagine that's changed a lot with the, the new updates to physics and stuff. Okay, so... I guess you... you don't... That place began from the residence of intersecting points. They are memories replaced by ends and naught and etched into stone. Blood, young sprouts, sky. I feel like I'm ruining it speaking this bit. And the one with the ability to control beings created from light. In that world, it is said that if one should wish it, one can bring back the souls of the dead. 
Wouldn't that be something? Okay. But to trespass upon that land is strictly forbidden. So she's dead. And I wish to bring her back to life, if I'm understanding that correctly. The sound. It's giving me chills a little bit, like the sound of it. I mean, I know the graphics have been updated. Uh oh, what? Well, that's probably not a good thing. The horse knows. Listen to it. Okay, am I going to get into it now? Is this my first little taste and lick of action? Stay away from my horse! I care for it more than that that girl who is dead. Ooh. It really does give me chills, the sounds. I'm really... Oh. Just like that, huh? <laughs> okay. I thought, it, I thought I'd have a little bit of a stabbing contest on my hands there, but I guess not. Yes, I possess the ancient sword. She was sacrificed. It's not all Amir's war. A little click if the leads to is. I don't appreciate the laughter. Good. Really, really. I can see where this is going. Okay, so they are. They are the Colossus on the side then. How do I take them out? Colossi. Thought it was. Thought that was a plural. Okay. If thou defeat those colossi, get to the point. I see where it's going. The idol shall fall. Okay. I do understand. I do. Ooh. Sinister. You do new. Says the hero, glowing radiance with courage. I 
I didn't expect it not to be um, English. You know, not that it's a bad thing. It might be a little bit of a bad thing for um, a YouTube video, I guess, because it's going to require you to read as well. I feel like I ruin it if I talk over it and read it out to you. Head to the place where the sword's light gathers. Okay. I'll just leave her there, shall I? I can move the camera now. That's sudden. Look at me ruin the moment. <laughs> it's all beautiful. And I can just ruin everything. Here I am, I'm moving. Hooray! And I got my fist clenched like I'm ready for action. Be on thy way. Well, I will be on my way, but I'm a little bit concerned about leaving this, this dead woman here, whoever she is, sister, girlfriend, wife, someone, mother, a little bit young to be a mother, but who knows? Mothers are younger every time now, so who, who knows? Who knows what happens? Extra jump. Okay. Well, it doesn't necessarily feel so bad like a PS2 game. It feels all right. In a sunlit place, hold up the sword using R1 and look where the light beam focuses. Okay, well, I'm, I'm not like in the sunbeam spot. Is this sun? Is there sunbeam from the roof down here? Oh, there it is. Okay, it's blue now. What does it all mean? <laughs> I don't know. Let's head out here, and we have a destination to go. Go. Actually, no. I want to look over here. Can I look over here? I should just head to the destination and defeat our first. Uh, Colossus, which I'm excited about, really excited about, to finally get in this game after so many years of wanting to play it. I'm really excited to finally do it. But let's take a look around here. Very cool. It's all open from what I, what I understand. I mean, I have a horse, so I guess it would be. But I'm wondering how big the world would be. Can I? Let's raise the sword. Look at how magnificent. There it is, now I can see it. Okay, because I'm actually out in the light. Okay, so I gotta head over there. Simple, I could do that. Let's go get my horse. Uh, assuming it's still not, you know, being chased by shadow creatures, which I can only assume that it will not be, because my horse is brave and it would have stomped on him and said, No, no, shadow creatures. Not today, shadow creatures, not today. That's what it would have said. Oh. Press triangle or X when the aggro to mount. Okay, so the name of the horse is aggro. Okay. Aggro. 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 I will. I'm very tempted to do that for about 37 minutes, but I shall not try. I shall just jump on you straight away, which I don't know how to do. So I'm just going to be rolling around you, doing very weird, slightly attacking you, which I didn't mean to do. I'm going to be attacking you and doing things until I work out how to. Do triangle again. Okay, press triangle to make aggro run faster. All right. Let's, let's get the hell out of here, aggro. Yeah, don't don't go straight down into in, into the, into the little watery depths or whatever may lie in there straight away, aggro. Yeah. I guess I gotta go back out this way. It seems like really tricky to navigate. Yeah. Yeah. I guess I do. Yeah. Do I? Do I? Do I? Yeah. I mean, doesn't want to go up there, so I guess not. Maybe I go out the other way. Maybe there's an easier way, which is often the case. You go through all these, these treacherous paths in this journey across mountaintops and everything to get to places like this. And then you finally get here, and there's a back entrance. Maybe that's that's the case. Yeah. I, I'm, I'm already, like, stuck. Yeah. Seems very awkward navigating the horse. Jump yeah. down, aggro. Jump down to your doom, maybe. No? Okay, don't do that. Okay, well, I'm stuck already. I'm gonna find my way out though, don't worry about it. Is that it? Is it this easy? Oh, it's this easy. God damn it. Yeah. Of course yeah. it's this easy. It's just stairs right here next to the thing. Alright, I can't, like. Yeah. This horse yeah. has a mind of its own. It's like it's its own goddamn beast or something. This feels cool. I like the camera. Assuming I don't have to fight on horseback or something, which. Oh, let's do that. That's felt. Oh, that feels good! Just riding a horse into battle, raising your arm in the air with the light shining off it. Feels good. Don't jump off, buddy. Don't jump Agro. off. Agro. Agro. I'm sorry, I'll try not 
I'm gonna try not to bug my horse too much. The land looks pretty huge. It's very barren, which normally would be a very bad thing, but remember, this this is an old game, it's just retextured and everything. Also, sometimes it could be a, a artistic and stylistic choice. Display the map. Okay, here's our map. Alright then. That's the size of the map. Okay, we got all the Colossus around the sides. There's a lot of Colossus. If those are all the, the looks like Colossi. If those are all the Colossi around the sides that I got to hunt, there's a lot more than I expected. I thought there would only be a few. But I guess this game is longer than I anticipated it being. This is definitely the way I have to be, I think. Uh, I'll double check again. It is. Yeah, that's the way I gotta go. Okay. Nice and simple, nice and easy. But I'm digging this game so far. I haven't really done anything apart from awkwardly controlled a horse. But I'm liking it. It's our first challenge, I guess. Little bit of climbing. Little bit of, little, little bit of uh, precariousness. That's fine. I can handle it. Wait here, Agro! I got it, buddy. Don't, don't you worry about a thing. I will have it. I will have it. How do I put my sword away? I don't want my sword out all the time. It's distracting me. Maybe I can climb up this? Yes! Oh, R2 and use something to climb. Okay, so I gotta hold down a button to climb. Can't just climb up by jumping on stuff. Fair enough, that makes sense. I mean, you're gonna have to grip stuff in real life if you wanna climb. Makes sense you gotta grip stuff in this game as well. And I'm pretty sure a large part of the game is actually climbing, so I should really get used to it. Uh, set. Oh, there we go. Oh, no. <laughs> where, where am I? Where, j jump at the right place. Come on, buddy. What's my character's name? Have I missed that? I don't know if I've missed that or not. Uh, I don't know the, the girl's name other than she was just a sacrifice, so that's kind of interesting. But a sacrifice for what? What kind of culture do you come from, I do wonder? Execute the dive roll, don't worry, I already worked out the dive roll earlier on. Wow. I know what people mean already when they talk about sense of scale. Like, again, I don't really have the the, the feeling of nostalgia because I've never played this before. And I've heard that it gets lost eventually. The first time a lot of people played this when initially it came out, people were dumbstruck and in awe by the size and just... The magnitude of all the, the size of everything. Um, ooh. Ooh, there it is. I'm glad I'm playing this with headphones on, because I feel like it really amplifies the feel of everything. There it is. Wow. As I was saying, conveniently still appropriate, the sense of scale is definitely evident here, but I always heard that it kind of got lost when technology advanced. It, it kind of got lost when uh, games advanced and brought bigger stuff into it anyway, but I still feel it. I still feel kind of in awe by this thing. It is huge, and I guess the, the sound design really helps to that as well. I'm totally gushing over the sound design in this game. But how do I get on top of it? There's, there's a blue thing there. Hold up thy sword to reflect the light onto the Colossus, is vital, sh it vital shall be revealed. Okay, well I've forgotten the buttons for that already. Oh god, it's turning around. I don't want it to see me and get very, very angry. I'm pretty sure I saw the vitals anyway, right? Yeah, see, I saw that. I saw it, but I got a trophy out of it, so that's very good, I suppose. I can climb on the, the hairy leg of this thing. Got it. There you go. While holding on, press and hold square to raise your sword. Press square again for a stab attack. Okay. I'm stabbing it. <laughs> stabbing it. The longer you accumulate power in your attack, something happens. Oh. He felt that. As he would, because I stabbed him in the ankles. Now's my chance to climb. He's bent over and I'm climbing on its hairy little buttocks. It's not a little buttocks, it's a big buttocks. I've rarely seen a buttocks quite that size. But he's trying to shake me off. He's ahead of his time in dance moves, obviously. Trying to twerk me off his buttocks there, but it's not going to work, buddy. It's not going to work. I'm guessing I have to get right to the top of his head and stab it. I'm guessing that's how that works. Try not to fall off, I guess. 
Get onto it, Sam. There you go. This is cool, man. This is this is really cool. I'm liking this. And again, the music is excellent. What's that button? It's telling me golden stuff. Why is it telling me that? Uh, get on here. There you go. Almost up to the top. I'm gonna feel really bad for doing this, buddy. All right. I mean, why do I have to stop you? I just I want to bring my 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 sister or girlfriend or something back to life. But oh god, hello! I'm on your face. I'm on your face. Don't worry about it. I'm sure it's probably quite. Oh no! Ow! Owie. That did not do good. I was right there. What is the glowy telling me, man? I keep forgetting the buttons of the glowies. I feel like this guy wants to stab me a little bit. And I'll be honest, I wouldn't blame him. Because after all, I'm climbing on him trying to kill him. For whatever reason, he has no idea. But I'm gonna tell you now, it's gonna happen when I drive my sword right into you. There you go. And there's his health, I guess. Top left is health. Which my face cam hopefully shouldn't be covering. I should change that. But if it is, his health is in the top left. And I've done a terrible job of organizing the face cam position in this game. Okay, wait here. Oh no, I jumped! Oh god damn it. I did that on purpose. I didn't like not on purpose. I pressed the button that made me jump then. I didn't really want to. Hold on, buddy. Hold on. And this is harder than it looks. I got up there, like, the first try last time, and now, I mean, he's shaking me off, and he's really ruining it for me. If I kill him a little bit, hurt him greatly. Oh, nuts. If I, if I, come on, stab him. Stab him, buddy. There you, there you go, there you go. Now's my chance. Get up. There you go. I can't fi- Oh, god damn it, stop falling off. Falls off all the goddamn time he does. What is the golden thing? Is that my sword? Telling me this, but I know it. You don't have to tell me these things. Oh, look at him. What is the golden stuff? Maybe that is like, um, my grip, right? Like, yeah, it's my grip. That's my grip. The golden BP glowy things is my grip by the looks of it. Like, so I have to kind of wait for it to grow again, and then I'll have an easier time uh, latching onto stuff and not falling off. I guess that's what that means. That's what I'm getting out of it anyway. That's what I'm going to choose to assume that's what that means. Are you okay? You're not okay. I'm trying to stab you. You must be very annoyed. i got to wonder what kind of life you lead. You just march around here. Do you eat? Would you like to go for a bite? Maybe we can be friends. Look at the size of his hand, my god. Okay, there we go. We're up again. Give it a little bit of a rest. We'll be up again. And stab him! I've got to remember to take my time. I'm trying to kill a Colossus, after all. This isn't something you do every day. Take my sweet little time. Also, get up to the next bit, which is this bit. Would be probably good, instead of going straight for the arm, which is what I seem to be doing. Come on, get up. There you go. There I go! Okay, this is what I haven't been doing for some goddamn reason. I've been going straight to the arm every time. I don't know why, because I don't have to do that. But I wait here, and I'm on- No! No, you silly, silly boy! Is he boy? Is he man? Is he a man? But he looks really boyish. I can't tell. I can't tell. Is he meant to be a man or a boy? I don't know. There's lots of questions. I'm assuming I'll find out the answers eventually at some point. Stop shaking me. Stop shaking me, please. There you go. Ah, there you go. Stab him. He felt my stabs. Now he's going to feel me clambering all over his soft buttocks again. I feel like he might have some skin problems. I mean, that's a, that's a quite an odd observation to make, obviously. But his, his skin underneath the fur, which looks magnificent, by the way. I haven't pointed out the fur is bloody magnificent looking. Skin underneath the fur looks a little bit rough. A little bit coarse. Like you can use... Like you can use cream or some kind of ointment. There you go, climb up. There you go. Yeah, you climb up to the next bit. Come on, buddy. Come on, he's shaking me, but don't let him do it. That would be why I fell off the face the first time when I was right there. I wasn't focused on stamina or anything, but now I know stuff. I've learned. Took me longer than it should have done, but I've learned stuff, you 
I've learned stuff, you. Let me get right to the top of your dome here. There it is. There's a glowy spot on his dome. That would be the placement for my sword. Oh, it's big, isn't it? It's a big placement for my sword. I'm sorry, buddy. Oh, I'm sorry. God, that took out a load of health. Oh, and now he's spraying like blackness. Is he made of oil? Maybe he's made of oil. He's a highly sought after commodity, obviously. That'll do it, finally. His head is spraying like a geyser. It's really sad. Why did I have to kill him? Like, it's quite sad, really. I don't want to kill him. What are they supposed to be? I mean, they're just beings, if anything. They're just living their lives. Suddenly, I come over here and kill him. And I don't have an explanation other than I just want to revive a lost loved one. And then I become one with the oil. And die. Because you're not supposed to consume oil. Most people know that. It's a very stupid thing to be doing. And now I'm inside the TARDIS. Okay. Maybe I'm teleporting. That'd be nice and easy, a teleporting, if I gotta go back to the shriney place. I don't have to run back there every time. It doesn't seem like there's a lot of stuff worth hanging around in the world to see afterwards, so... But I've just began. What do I know? Ooh, shadow. I had a thought. Are the Colossi like lost souls or something and they're represented by the shadow people or something like that? And I, I'm freeing them, maybe. I'm freeing them. I'm doing good and then they'll bring my girl back to life. Maybe, am I looking too far ahead and things like that? Perhaps. But it's the kind of game that inspires theories and, and questions as you pursue yourself through it, obviously. That's one down. That's the one. Pretty easy, I say. Once I got the hang of it, it took me a long time to climb. I was being a bit of a dummy with the climbing, but it took me... I, I got there. I got there eventually. I did get there. And at the end of the day, that's all that matters. Thy next foe is... In the seaside cave, it moves slowly. Okay. I have the courage. Lots of it. Buckets of it. Not that you can see the buckets, they're invisible buckets of courage. But I have lots of it, trust me, believe me. I am boy with horse, called Agro, and I shout it sometimes. Agro! Agro! I shout it all the time, he never stops. She's gonna be like extra cold, right? Uh, assuming she's dead because she was a sacrifice, that's what everything's pointing at. She's gonna be extra cold when she wakes up. I just lay her, lay her there in this breezy area with no shoes, no socks. I don't even give her socks. What kind of a meanie am I? Such a meanie, I am such a meanie. But I'm gonna end this episode here, I think. Um, I think now's a good time. We just we stopped one Colossus. I think that's the time. I want these episodes to be kind of longer because obviously less editing uh, is going to um, equal longer episodes, but that's the point of it. But I really enjoyed this. I'm actually really immersed and into it already. I'm really excited to see the next Colossus, which is on the seaside place, and I've got to muster up the courage, but I can't because I have all the courage in the world. I can't muster up any more possibly. But I got my horse. I got my dead woman. I got the ability to think, feel, and express myself in this world by the stabbings of my swords. And I'm going to hunt more Colossus. So if you liked it and you do want to see more of this game, you want this series to continue, the style it has. And if you're interested in this style of video, as opposed to the usual style, which is more kind of heavily chopped up and edited, let me know. Because this is very much a experiment as well. And I I'd like to know your opinion. I know there's a lot of people that like lots of different things. It's a lot of people that like this kind of thing. Obviously, this game has been around for a long time. I'm assuming a lot of people have played it. But either way, I'm not expecting it to do as well as the other ones, but it'd be kind of nice to do uh, to, to counterbalance some things occasionally. So let me know down below what you think. 
and I'll see each and every one of you in the next times. So thank you very much for watching, and I shall see each and every one of you in the next video. So, so long, farewell, good, goodbye, goodbye, goodbye. I'm a man with a sword, with a, a hunger for killing. I got a hunger for killing, and it can't be quenched.